Hey everyone, this is Craig from AuraPub.com. I'm going to introduce you to my Oracle real-time session sampler. That's included in my OSM toolkit that is available for free from AuraPub.com. My objective is over a short interval to count the number of active Oracle sessions that are either consuming CPU or waiting to consume CPU. So I'm going to use the OSM tool called RSS for Real-Time Session Sampler. The first two parameters are related to the Oracle session ID, the low and the high. The next two are related to the Oracle session serial number, both the low and the high. The next parameter is going to allow me to either choose between displaying sessions that are consuming CPU, waiting to consume CPU, or for both, and the percentage sign meets both. And then if I'm waiting, the next parameter allows me to wildcard the wait event. The final parameter is the sample delay. So what this means is every five seconds, I'm going to capture and display all the sessions that meet the criteria from the previous parameters. Okay, let's give it a go. Now, this is a lot of information. So first is a summary of what we just entered in that's in English. The next area, it's gonna tell us where the output of the sampling is actually going to be. It's gonna be in the slash temp directory. And so sampling has started. So let's take a look. So we're gonna do tail dash F on the output file. And then real soon we get our first sample right there. And if you look closely, you can see every five seconds we are sampling. Now remember, this is coming straight from V$ session. It's just like a snapshot in a way. And so you can see there's different sessions connected. Some are waiting for CPU and some are actually consuming CPU. Okay, let's take a look at the details from our sample set number five. If you look closely, you can see that we have a number of sessions, some consuming CPU and some waiting. In fact, two sessions are waiting and six sessions we caught consuming CPU. So now that we have sample counts, we can create a visual representation of this. So what this chart is showing us is that for sample set number five, nearly 80% of the active Oracle sessions were consuming CPU.